T.I. Are you serious, bro? Hey, man, hit the like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications, follow your boy on IG. What is you doing? Follow your boy on IG and subscribe to your boy's second channel. The podcast channel is lit over there. Without further ado, let's get it. Let's go. Bro, look me in my face. We both knew you wasn't talking. Bro, bro. <laughs> he didn't want to get canceled. He had to, he had to stop himself. I, I respect him for that. He had to stop himself. Because I already knew what he was going to say. Well, I had an idea of what he was going to say. He was not going to say I was going to keep confronting He was going to say something else, but he had to stop himself. <laughs> Okay, um, <laughs> bro, T.I., this makes you look like a straight, you know what, you feel me? First of all, let me this let me get this out the way. First of all, I need everybody to, bro, a comedian's job is to make people laugh, correct? All right? So if you get offended by a joke that a comedian says about you, what gives you the right to go on? What do these famous people have? Like, this is the second person that came on stage and physically touched somebody. You didn't hit her because, you know, if you hit her, it would have been raps for you, my boy. You feel me? But you still physically touched her, trying to hold her and telling her to shut the F up and this and that. And, bro, you did way too much. It, look, This is how I look at it. If you know you didn't do something, why are you so defensive about it? If you know you didn't do it, why are you so defensive about it? Because when you know you didn't do something, you don't tend to get defensive about something that you didn't do. All right? Let a person talk. She was talking. She was talking her mess. She was making a joke. Let her talk, bro. That's what comedians do. Comedians are to are supposed to make jokes and and make other people laugh. You was just the punchline, all right, to her joke. Simple as that. You know, and, and for you to come on stage and shut the F up. Don't play with me about money. Bro, come on. You did way too much. I'm just glad you didn't hit her because that would have been raps for you, my boy. You would have been all over TMZ and you probably would have been in, behind bars right now. Cause you hitting a woman, but the still, but the whole purpose is, bro. Don't physically like. I don't know why people, or just famous people, like this. Is just the second time this happened, and within less than a month, what Will's want to smack people over a woman that don't care about him really. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> don't care about him at all. Done, done manipulated her child by thinking that Tupac is this and that. That's a whole nother story for a different day. But then you got T.I. Like, I see why he's mad. You know what I'm saying? I, I understand that. Just how I understand, understood why Jada felt some type of way. You feel me? I understand that. But y'all have to realize that these are comedians. This is what they do. This is your job. You you know this person's a comedian. You at a comedy show. You famous. Your name is T.I. Of course, she's going to make you the punchline to her joke. Simple as that. But I just feel like, you know, it's certain things, like I, like, it's certain things that you don't play about. But at the end of the day, I understand you're a comedian. You feel me? I understand you're a comedian. That That's just the whole purpose of it. This is a comedian. Okay? Simple as that. I've never seen her, never heard of her before, but this is a comedian. Simple as that. 
And T.I., bro, you need to, like, this made you look like a complete simp, bro. I, it's okay for guys to be emotional, but, bro, being this emotional like this, letting your emotion get the best of you like this in front of a whole bunch of women, this make you look like the female. This don't make you look like no man. It doesn't make you look like a man at all. And people are so, oh, well, he don't look like a man for stepping up for his girl, this and that, that. I'm not saying that at all. You feel me? But when you let your emotions get the best so you can handle stuff in private. That's what people fail to realize is that being a man is handling that stuff in private. You ain't got to show off. You ain't got to act all tough in front of a whole group of people. You ain't got to talk to her in private. Just how Will should have talked to, talk to freaking uh, Chris Rock in private. It's called talking to each other in private. You ain't got to show off. You ain't got to let the whole world know what y'all do because now you're getting canceled. Y'all let me know what y'all think about the situation, man. T.I., bro... I, Look, I get why you was mad. You know, it was this rape charge or whatever against you and your wife, whatever it was, okay? But my whole thing is, and I I learned this as, as a kid, if you really, if you not mad, I mean, if you know you didn't do something, don't get defensive about it. Because the more you get mad about something that you didn't do, it's going to make you look more guilty of doing what you didn't do. You see what I'm saying? I had to learn that as a kid. It's like, people will tell, you did this, you didn't, I'll get all defensive. I ain't do it. I ain't do it. I ain't do it. And I'll start crying and whining, but people don't care about that. It's like, bro, you did it, bro. Come on now. Like, it's like... You feel me? But anyways, man, y'all let me know what y'all think about the situation in the comment section below. I love all, I love each and every one of y'all, bro. Thank you for 47K on my mama. Thank you for 47K. Yeah, boy. Anyways, I love y'all, man. Uh, y'all have a blessed rest of y'all day. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.